Hello and welcome to Office Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to place shopping cart icon even if your theme doesn't support the shopping cart icon in the menu. For example, I'm using 2021 theme, uh, 2022 theme for my website. I can use Astra because it already have it. But uh, in case you have a theme which do not have the shopping cart functionality, but you are using the WooCommerce plugin for your products. So let's add a new plugin uh, for the shopping cart. I have these products added. Uh, these are all the uh, affiliate products, but this one is the dropship products or it's available on my shop. So let's add this to cart and add another product. If we have it here or let's just add another one with one more quantity then you can go to the uh, shopping cart page let's add to cart here you can go to shopping cart page from uh, using the menu but uh, there is no floating icon or if you are on the home page or anywhere on your website uh, your user cannot see the shopping cart floating icon so let's just add the shopping uh, floating icon uh, for this you will have to go to plugins click on add new and in the search bar let's type floating um, shopping or floating cart press enter floating cart icon XT cart for WooCommerce you can use this one a modern floating cart uh, side cart for WooCommerce uh, it will also do the function uh, when you click on the floating cart it will uh, grab from the side whichever products are in the cart so click on install now after installation activate the plugin Now here is the menu for XT plugin. Uh, click on XT plugin and click on floating cart. Skip this step or you can allow it. Okay, general or the cart setting. Let's click on general first. It will be opened in the customizer and uh, you can see that there is a shopping cart already let's see if it's on the front end yes the floating cart is there and we have we are on the home page if you go to the shop page then it will still be there and you know how many products are there uh, so currently there are three if we add another one then uh, it's Ajax ba based uh, and it will automatically uh, turn to 4. If you click on the shopping cart it will uh, give you a nice um, accordion and it will uh, show you the products which are already in the cart. You can go directly to checkout page by clicking here or you can just uh, stay on this page or you can go to the cart page from the menu. So let's start customizing this force Ajax initialization. It means that uh, when you click on add to cart or for any product, it will automatically go uh, send an Ajax call and it will add this product here. Log page scroll when active. Yes. Three bounce, chasing doors, cart loading spinner. It's the, this one. Okay, cart loading spinner color. So this is probably the uh, setting for and the shopping cart you can set the cart the trigger the offset uh, let's see the positioning if we have the positioning and we can set it to the top show on all mobile uh, let's see if we have the placement
we have the trigger setting. Uh, for example, you have to click on the cart to view all the products. Uh, you can click on mouse over uh, or click. So uh, both will be working here. If you hover this, it will automatically get the shopping cart active. So let's see placement. So in the customizer, in the floating cart, you have a cart settings menu. And here you can uh, add it to top left or top right or bottom left or bottom right. So we will keep it on top right and click on publish. Now let's go to the front end and refresh and it will be on the top right. Uh, currently we are logged in that is why it's hovering there. So if you hover it, it will automatically be collapsed. Let's see if we have the top position. You can set the top position to 60 px. So it will not be over uh, behind that menu. Let's refresh it again. And we have a nice shopping cart icon uh, just where we want it. Even if your theme have the shopping cart functionality, you can still use this one. Let's exit to dashboard and let's change the theme to Astra because Astra already have the shopping cart icon added to the uh, menu. Let's activate it and go to front end. Let's check the home page. You can see we have the shopping cart icon here as well. And we are uh, using this shopping cart icon as well. So in this case, I will move the shopping cart icon to the bottom. So come to parents, come to customize and uh, for the floating cart, I will choose the location for bottom left or bottom right. Floating cart, cart settings. So bottom left here or bottom right here. And we still have that Astra's own option in the menu. So uh, to modify the Astra's own option, you can just click on this pen icon while uh, customizing the website. Just click here and it will show you the settings for the shopping cart, the, the, the menu, the admin menu or this second menu. Let's edit here and you can change the shopping cart icon to be used here. It's a bag, it's a cart or it's a basket. So whatever you want and the currency, uh, the cart total currency symbol, this one. So uh, this is how you can add or modify the shopping cart icon or the floating shopping cart for um, the WordPress website or the WooCommerce website. So uh, I guess you learned something from here. Uh, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and you will not miss our future updates. Thank you.